Good afternoon, I'm Rachel Hart. <laughs> and I'm Logan Weeder, and this is Wolfpack News for Monday, October 6, 2014. Spirit items, including class color beads, scarves, glasses, and wolf tattoos will be available before school through Wednesday at the Commons Concession Stand. Everything is $5 or less. Senior class shirts will be available for pickup Tuesday <laughs> before school in the Commons Concession Stand. Seniors, don't forget to get your cookie dough orders turned in by this Friday for your free ticket to Senior Celebration and Senior Brunch. Today is the start of Spirit Week. Here's a look at what you should wear each day. Today you should be wearing pajamas. Tomorrow is Chicago Sports Day. Wednesday is Class Color Day and teachers should wear pink. Thursday is Throwback or Decade Day and Friday is Spirit Day. Remember, no hats or capes and you should be wearing shoes today. Do you enjoy reading, like to drink coffee, tea or hot chocolate and want to hang out in, the, in after school on alternative Wednesdays? Then come to the OELRC. Mrs. Fairless is ho hosting a book club open house in the LRC next Wednesday, October 8th at 2.35. The book club open house is a meet and greet of sorts where every student is welcome and encouraged to discuss what books they enjoy reading, get social with their fellow students, as well as help create a book reading list for future meetings. Boulder Hill Elementary School is looking for volunteers to help with their up and coming events. Come to Student Services for more information. Plank Junior High School is looking for volunteers to help scare Oswego zombie style. Come to Student Services to see the many opportunities available for service hours. We have several announcements for the OE seniors. The senior panoramic picture is October 20th at 9 a.m. Harif Jones Ring Night is October 27th from 5 to 7 p.m. Tables will be set up by the Commons at the front of, at the, front of the school. And finally, order your cap and gown and graduation invitations October 28th and November 5th during all lunches. Homecoming week involves competitions between classes for points. Student Council Representative Joe Sanchez is here with Kristen to explain how it works. Hi Joe, thanks for being here. I love your Grinch pajama pants. Let's talk about the competitions this week for homecoming. How can classes earn points this week? So um, each class can earn points through dress up days. So there are five, and then obviously lunch games, excluding Thursday. Thursday is karaoke. Um, students can also earn points for their class through powder puff, hallway decorations, um, and final um, events at the homecoming assembly. That sounds great. How are points tallied? Uh, points are tallied off of a four, three, two, one system. So for any event, um, like, for example, tug of war at the assembly, um, the first place class will get four points, second place will get three, um, third place will get two, and last place will get one. Um, and like for dress up days, um, the student body, like for each class, is tallied up and then divided by the total amount in that class to get a percentage, and then from there we um, assign a four, three, two, or one. Awesome. Anything else to add? Um, yes, there is a maximum total of 60 points per class throughout for the entire week, even leading up to the final um, events at the assembly. Um, so no classes will be going, going over 60 points. And other than that, go Wolves. Awesome. Thanks, and good luck to all the classes. Now back to the anchor desk. The Alpha Theta's first meeting is today after school in room E392. Members will be signing the new contract. Spread the word to other Mu Alpha Theta members. Please let Mrs. Newton or Mrs. Gossett know 24 hours in advance if you cannot attend. And now it's time for entertainment. Here's Miranda. Homecoming tickets are on sale during all lunches. Tickets are $25 in advance and $30 at the door. You can save up to $3 by bringing in three canned good items. Make sure you have a current school ID when purchasing tickets and bring it to the dance to get in. At this year's homecoming, students can request music. The dance theme is A Night in the City and will be DJed by B96. They want to know what you want to hear. Go to boomentertainment.com backslash Oswego East and click on the request button. You can request as many songs as you want. Now back to the anchor desk. Students should sign up for college visits this week. Here's a list of colleges and when they're coming.
sign up for visits and student services. And now it's time for sports. Here's Miranda again. Congratulations to the girls varsity cross country team who won the Niles West Invitational on Saturday. Abby Kane, Alexis Hens, and Hannah Bauer led the Wolves to their first championship of the season. Also, congratulations to the JV team who took second place. They were led by Molly Schiltz, Rachel Rashi, and Il Ali Filichikia. And now back to the Anchor Desk. And finally, juniors and seniors who want to pursue a degree in the health healthcare field can get experience at Dr. Rubin's Mini Medical School in January 2015. If interested, fill out an application in student services and turn it in by Friday. That's today's edition of Wolfpack News. I'm Rachel Hart. And I'm Logan Weeder. Join us again next tomorrow on East TV Channel 16. Thanks for stopping by, Wolves, and have a great day.